Hey there, this is Crystal and we're creating name tags from Excel and we're moving them over to Microsoft Word. You ever go to those luncheons or networking events where they have your name on a little name tag? Yes, they have them, probably in an Excel file and you can merge them into a Word document. Really nice way to do this. So I'm starting in Word and I'm in mailings and I'm starting the mail merge and I'm saying that I want labels. Now when I have the labels, I already have the label as Avery US Letter and here's the 5392 name badges that I like for the basis for my file. And now I'm actually going to go back to Start Mail Merge and do the step-by-step -step mail merge wizard. So I can go through the six steps to actually print out my merge. So I've done step one. I actually have the parameters of the label. So I'm going to start selecting the recipients. I'm going to browse my list and find my Excel file. And my Excel file has a couple of tabs in it, so I should definitely be aware of which tab and which names I want to use. So here's my Excel file. And when I choose the file, if there's multiple tabs, it will always give me which tab names are listed there. So I want this particular tab. The first row are going to be the column headers. So I'm going to just click OK. And then it's just going to confirm, well, these are the names. I can check or uncheck people on this list. That's perfect. So I'm just going to say OK. Now I'm going to start arranging my labels. And once I click right here and arranging my labels, where my cursor is, I actually want this address block to be in the cursor location. So once I click address block, it just, well, which names do you want me to put in there? It's already extracting first and last name. That's perfect for me. So I'm just going to click OK. This is a piece that's very important. Towards the bottom of this step, it says replicate labels. All I'm going to do is update all labels so that address block goes to each label and it goes to the next record. I'm going to preview my labels. Wow, that looks great. I can always go in, change the font, change the size if I need to. And now I'm going to complete the merge. I'm going to edit my individual letters all my records and my labels come right up. I can always, always save this new document and change the font, size, color, whatever I'd like to do. So that's saving name tags and creating name tags with your Excel database. This is Crystal. See you soon.